The Tri-Cape entry in the Carpenter Cup softball tournament got off to a rough start Monday, but readied its ship in time to snag the top spot in its group and advance to Wednesday's championship round. Tri-Cape seemed to take command of its opening game against Burke's LL with a four-run fifth inning as Clayton's Cassie Wright doubled in a pair of runs and scored on a two-run triple by Katie Dayton of St. Joe Hamilton. But a moment later, Burks put up five runs in the sixth and won 6-4. Dayton went five for seven on the day with a double and two triples on number 22, Olivia Catalina of Cedar Creek added three hits, including an RBI single and a 6-5 win over Philadelphia Catholic, and the hit that brought the only run across in a ring-shortened one nothing win over Delaware County. Also advancing was the Olympic Colonial team, which opened with a 6-2 win over Interact, then won an 11-6 shootout from Burlington County. Paul VI's Alexa Lee tripled in a run early in that game. Michaela Lee of Gateway tripled twice as Olympics scored three runs each in the fifth and sixth innings to break open a tie game. I mean, I don't really swing it outside or inside pitches. I kind of just wait for it to be right down the middle. And then just basically just taking my hands right to the ball. That's really it. Olympics win over Burlington, plus its 8-7 loss to Lehigh Valley in the final game eliminated the Burlington squad, which also went 2-1. It was a lot of fun. It, you know, that, what I told the girls was that it was nice for me, one, to be on the same side as them and instead of them kicking our ass like they did in the spring. But um, it was nice to see as the day progressed how they kind of came together as a team a little bit. And, there, and you, you were in the dugout. You saw, like, that last game, they really were enjoying each other's you know, as teammates. Burlington beat Lehigh Valley 1-0 in its opener on a sacrifice fly by Tyler Douglas of Burlington Township. A two-run double by New Egypt's Michaela Weber highlighted a seven-run sixth inning as Burlington closed with a 7-5 win over Interact. The beginning came too late to make a winner of Lenape pitcher Maya Kanasiak, but she was a force in the game as she'd been in the opener. Today, I think just location and spin. I mean, that was key in everything because, I mean, they couldn't, they couldn't touch it, then I knew I was good. I pitched well, my defense worked right behind me, and I think overall we did well today. From FDR Park in Philadelphia, this is John Lewis.